Good morning, Ox. Good morning. This is the Ox and Q show in the morning. Yeah. You know, Ox, when I was a, a little boy, uh, a couple weeks ago, <laughs> just a moment ago, actually, right? Still a little boy, in many ways. Yeah. Um, I was taught never to hide your light under a bushel. What? Isn't that a song? Yeah, it is. What does that mean to you, and and also how does that relate to recovery? Your light under a bushel. I don't think under I ever bush heard that. Or under a lamp. Or... But I would think it would mean that once you get the spirit of God in you to share it, to not you know to show the light to be a bright spot in the world, to not mm. um, hide in darkness, which is doing evil things and being around people that are evil and, um, and that's what i would relate that to okay how about how does that relate to the 12th step of carrying the message of a spiritual awakening hmm. yeah once we work those steps and um, we know the key to success in sobriety it's important to carry that message to other addicts and alcoholics and to uh and to practice those principles in all our affairs of course but to um to help with them and maybe to be a sponsor someday mm -hmm. and to help them work through their fourth and fifth step as far as uh, achieving long-term permanent sobriety is the goal. Mm. I guess as a, as a little kid, I guess the light that you shine is that it's, it attracts other people mm -hmm. and they see that light in their darkness and that if you shut the lights off in our studio here and had a little candle, it would illuminate the whole room, possibly, and that's how our recovery should be. It should be uh, attracting others to mm -hmm. say, wow, if that person can do it, I can do it too. And the God right. that that person serves would think of that person, certainly God is big enough to help me as well. Right. Yeah, I've, I've tried uh, everything I could to, uh, to help others in sobriety, but... Uh, you know, it's all up to the person to put the to put the effort into it as well, too. It's about taking and, action. And about taking action. You know, I was listening to some radio this morning, and he was talking about that. Home home wages, unpaid bills, eviction notices, and eating ramen noodles at Thanksgiving dinner. If you're even a community college graduate, military <laughs> veteran, or grill cook and need relief from financial strain, Come join us and invest your future with Homeland Securities. We not only take your money, but invest it in such stocks as the Beirut Inn and Suites, the South Equator Ice Company, the <laughs> Chinese Chinese Sweatshops. Why distrust those stockbrokers when you can distrust us? Let us take all the risk at Homeland Securities. We wow. scrutinize everything and allow you to question our mistakes without backlash. <laughs> Here are a few of the testimonies from investors that shows our firm. Hey, my name is Steve. Uh, I invested $50,000 in Samco, a service to air missile company. And my Lebanese senior partners and I made a huge profit when stock in Samco went sky high. Why just trust the other guy when you can distrust us at Homeland Securities? Call now at 1-800. Oh, I'm going to call them now. <laughs> this has been The Ox. The Ox. And the Q Show, show in, in the, the morning. morning. And remember to shine your light. And remember Homeland Security.